Hello, 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 hello there, Aries. Aries, we are here for your love reading for July 2016. I hope you all been good. Hope the month has been nice to you. Hope your love life has been exceptional. I am your host. I am Charles. I am your reader. I am your spiritualist. I am your soothsayer. I have been called many things through the years, and there are people like me in every generation, and I thank you for joining me in this lifetime. Kind of heavy, huh? But anyway, Aries, welcome back. New people, welcome to the site. I'm Charles, like I said, Mr. Charles to many, the original, and... If you're not a subscriber, well, you can click that box down there with me on top of it at any time to subscribe. And if you are already a subscriber, I thank you very much. But let's get into this reading. While well, the cards are hot, the cards are always hot. You know, people ask me, are you ready? I wouldn't be here if I wasn't ready. Let's do it. Harry's Love July. 2016 well a love from the past is coming back and this person will let them know let, let you know you know them to me will let you know that they're around uh, probably in the first part of July I try not to deal on the past unless it has something to do with the present or the future Okay, I try not to waste time there because, you know, you know what your past has been like. You don't need me to waste time going through that stuff. Uh, anyway, uh, man, it looks like your relationship is going strong. You know, it's not what it's not the married people. It's people who are dating each other. And man, it looks like your relationship's going strong. It looks like it's going to get stronger in July. Uh, women, it looks like you are a little unsure on how your relationship's going, but it, it's, it's actually going better than you think. You might wonder if your partner is really that into you. Well, yes, your partner is into you. I want to say, well, he, but, you know, nowadays it could be a she. And, yes, I do deal with same-sex relationships. I have no issues with that. Uh, let's see, and many of you will find out that someone likes you, all right? This person will approach you. And if you, if you, get, if you get caught by surprise, well, and you're really not interested in that person, let them, down, let them down gently. You know, say maybe it's not the right time. Maybe, you know, if things are different in your life, you know, things, you know, could have worked out differently. But let them down gently. It's nothing that they did, you know. When a person likes you, well, that's very much a flattering situation. Um, some couples, you have mean, you have means, uh, you have the right, you have the thought of untrust in your partner. And uh, for some of you, I have to say that you have all rights to have that mistrust. All right, so let's leave that there. That's good there. We're doing a few more cards. Sorry, I hit the microphone. Okay, new outcome looks good. Looks good. Hopes and dreams look like they will be happening for you in the love department. Uh, if some of you just want to do that uh, hanky-panky, uh, swap fluids, that kind of thing, that sounds icky. But that's what it is. Um, it looks like you're going to get lucky in that department. And that's for our 18 and over groups. Uh, let's see. Uh, those of you who have been arguing lately, it looks like that's going to finally let up. You know, why have you been arguing lately? Can you really remember why you're arguing? Did it come because of a small thing that went out of hand and then people started saying things that they really didn't mean? Well, if you say some things you really didn't mean, well, leave the pride behind and tell your partner that 
hey, you know, maybe I, 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 you know, I said some things I really didn't mean. I was upset or something like that. Uh, man, um, I don't know if this fell into, well, it looks like it might have fell into another another scenario here, but it shows go after that person you're interested in. Well, it sort of goes into that, you know, where uh, someone else might have to let you down. But um, you're never going to know unless you go after it. You know, it's action that brings results. So, in men, you're going to find out of someone who likes you quite a bit and who has liked you for a long time. I'm not saying this is a person from the past. This is just someone who's been around you around you for a while so that's all looking good I'm gonna do one more set there's Aries Aries you wanna do one more, one, one, one more set I think I'm gonna need a drink of water 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 yeah I say that you know different accents pop up when I say certain words it's not the lack of education it's the lack of my mind Lack of my mind functioning, you know, what part of the world am I in? A little agua, a little agua to wet the whistle. Water, essence of life. You know, I didn't, you know, way back when, I, I didn't believe that they were actually going to charge for a bottle of water, with cups of water, you know. But then again, I didn't think the microwave would work way back when either, so I thought it was a fad. But so much for me, but yeah, those are some of my unsuccessful, unsuccessful premonitions. And microwave, no, oh, nobody's going to want radiated food. That's crazy. But I like my microwave. I like my microwave so much. You know, I, 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 I'd like to have a toaster oven. I've never had one of those toaster ovens. Make me a toasted peanut butter and jelly, toasted bologna and cheese sandwich. I'll get a toaster oven someday when I'm rich, right? Bam. Let's do that other set of cards right here. It's ready. Mm. Somebody trying on new perfume today. Those who know me. No, I can pick up scents, mm, and you smell mighty luscious and delicious, that new perfume. You know, some people say, oh, I don't wear perfume, it hides your natural scents. But no, there's nothing wrong with smelling like flowers and sweet stuff. It sure gets a guy's tinglers tingling, as they say, right? As I say. Yep, everything looks pretty good here. Um, we saw in those last cards, you know, you know, a distrust that shows that, uh, yeah, same thing. That some of you have a reason to distrust somebody that you're in a relationship to. Um, then don't, don't worry about, you know, these little nitpick arguments that you guys have been having. Leave that aside. Try to get rid of that. Try to lower that thing. You know, somebody must be, uh, stressing out over something outside of the household. It's not you, but... Sometimes they take it out on you, and it's not fair. It's not fair, but all we can do is be a little understanding. And let that person know that they're snapping at you, you know, when it's undeserved. Best thing you can do is don't snap back, because that just makes the other person even more grumpy. And that's what I got here. I got, you know, some of you are extra grumpy this month. And go out go out with each other this is for couples married boyfriend girlfriend go out have a little romance you know and to me romance dinner candlelight you know if you're in the adult relationship maybe even a little bubble bath together you know little flowers in the tub or something like that in the hot tub but you know just little things like that sure can bring the funk out of some relationships. Yeah, so. But that's just me, you know, come up with your own ideas. But I like the warm and the nice scents and 
whatever becomes of the situation. So let July be a good month to explore each other, explore good things, don't dwell on the bad things or the negative things. Let's bring this relationship closer. Some of you will need to get past your lie to get past some of your issues that are going on right now. Uh, ladies, don't doubt that your man does love you. He might not say it to you, but let's take a little extra look at his actions that he does for you. You know, no one needs to do anything for anyone. So when that other person does something for you, think about it, you know? You know, and let the person know that you appreciate it. So, anyway, it looks like that is good for Aries for July 2016. Uh, I picked this up, and I see that uh, uh, some of you have ways and means to get someone who isn't totally sure that they like you. You have ways and means to get this person closer to you. So that a relationship has a chance to develop. Well, on that closing note, remember to thumbs up the video, say hello to me in comments, or leave whatever comment you want. We only accept nice comments. You know, if you disagree, you disagree. Nobody says you have to take this information, right? Anyway, um, like I said, uh, thumbs up, leave comments, share the video where you can, your social networks or wherever. You know, we are becoming a channel to be recognized. Thank goodness, and it's all because of you. So please subscribe. If you're not a subscriber yet, click the little box with me on top that says Mr. Charles Subscribe. Or you can click my little bubbly, sparkly, click here to subscribe button. And it looks like it is going to be a really good month for you, Aries. And thank you, everyone else who joined in to look at this reading. It's my honor and my pleasure to do it with you because you are special and you really are. And I can feel it. And to all my friends around the world, thank you for coming in to see me. You need a more private reading? Well, you can get in touch with me. Just look down on. The description, well, it's uh, Mr. Charles at Yahoo.com. So, I am here for you, and I only take donations. I can't put a price on much of the things that I do here. Spiritual work, works, is something very special. All right, I'll see you around. Don't forget my morning rush readings every day, Monday through Friday. Release at midnight, Central Standard Time. Bye.